What is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and today you guys are going to be voting along with me for the 2020 WWE Slammy Awards poll. Finally, after five years, WWE have bought back the Slammy Awards. I loved these when I was younger. Slammy Awards are basically, for those of you that don't know, just little awards that WWE give at the end of the year. They're little trophies. Uh, they look like this. You can actually buy them on WWE Shop for an obscene price. Uh, I don't personally have a replica of one. <laughs> but they've bought the Slammy Awards back. The last time they did it was 2015. And for whatever reason, they just didn't do it after that. But this year, 2020, the Slammy Awards are coming back. And to vote for who you think uh, deserves to be each pick of the Slammy Awards. So, Superstar of the Year, Match of the Year. There's loads. Uh, you can actually vote on WWE.com. The link will be in the description. But you guys are going to be voting along with me today. Uh, let's see who I think should receive Slammy Awards in 2020. I'm going to set the camera up so you can see my screen, uh, screen record it with a little face cam, and then, uh, yeah, let's get right into the voting. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here we are. And first off, we have who should win the Slammy Award for Superstar of the Year, starting off with the biggest one. The categories, uh, category, sorry, we have the people here that are available to choose. Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns, Randy Orton, Braun Strowman, The Fiend, Asuka, Sasha Banks, Bailey, Becky Lynch or Charlotte Flair. Now, guys, without a doubt, uh, I am going with Drew McIntyre on this one. He has had a hell of a year. Two-time WWE Champion, winning his first WWE Championship at WrestleMania from Brock Lesnar, and then winning the second one a couple of weeks ago on Raw against Randy Orton. Drew has beaten literally everyone, all the top stars this year, except Roman Reigns. Uh, he's beaten Braun. He's beaten... Uh, oh, God, I've forgotten. <laughs> Actually, I don't even know if he's beaten Braun, but he's beaten Big Show. He beat Brock. He beat Randy. He beat Dolph. Uh, he beat Seth Rollins. You know, he's done it all. Drew McIntyre is my superstar of the year. Let's move on. Okay, so on to the next poll, which is, if it loads, can we get a drum roll, please? Yeah, that's what I like to see. Next poll, here it is. Which is the Slammy Award winner for match of the year? Okay. Undertaker versus AJ Styles, WrestleMania 36. The New Day versus The Hurt Business on Raw. Edge versus Randy Orton, Backlash 2020. The Men's Royal Rumble match, Royal Rumble 2020. Daniel Bryan versus Edge Styles from SmackDown June 12th, that was really good. Reigns versus Uso, Hell in a Cell, that was really good. Sasha Bailey, Hell in a Cell, once again good. AJ Styles, Jeff Hardy, Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns, and Becky Lynch versus Asuka. Oh, do you know what? See, I didn't think the Royal Rumble match could qualify as match of the year. I'm really torn here. I'm torn between Edge Randy at Backlash, the men's Rumble match, and AJ Styles versus Sami Zayn versus Jeff Hardy. But I'm going to go with the men's Rumble match, uh, strictly because, one, the Rumble was amazing this year with Drew McIntyre winning, another reason why he should be Superstar of the Year, and two, it's actually the only match on here that had a crowd. So, yeah, submit. Thanks for the vote. On to the next poll. What's this one going to be? Drum roll again, please, Joe. Oh, it's loading. Here we go. Which is the Slammy Award winner for Rivalry of the Year? Oh, okay. Drew versus Randy. Seth versus the Mysterio family. Edge versus Randy. Sasha versus Bailey. R Truth versus the World. Or Lana versus Announcers Tables. I'm going with Edge and Orton. Uh, the Mysterio Seth family. The what? The uh, the Seth Rollins Rey Mysterio family uh, was good, but I think it went on too long. Drew McIntyre Randy Orton was also a good feud, but. I have no clue why on earth Randy won the belt just to drop it. Um, Edge versus Randy, yeah, that's the one I'm going with. So, next poll. Okay, who are the Slammy Award winners for Tag Team of the Year? The Golden Role Models, Sasha Banks and Bailey, Nia Jackson, Shayna Baszler, The New Day, The Street Profits, or Shinsuke Nakamura and Cesaro. I am going with The Street Profits. They have held the Tag Team Championships. Uh, they won at the Royal Rumble, the Royal Tag Team Championships, and uh, they haven't lost ever since. They are, well, they switched the Tag Team titles, but technically, they've been Tag Team Champions since the Royal Rumble. They've nearly held Tag Titles for a year, so I'm going with The Street Profits. Next poll. Okay, who is the Slammy Award winner for Return of the Year? Uh, Edge, Roman Reigns, MVP, Goldberg or Sami Zayn? This one is a stupid question. 
question. It is quite clearly MV, I'm kidding, it is 100% edge. My reaction alone uh, is why I think it should be edge. If you haven't seen it, check it out. Here's a small clip. <gasps> So there you go, ladies and gentlemen, return of the year, 100% edge. That is it. I have done return of the year, tag team of the year, rivalry of the year, match of the year, and superstar of the year. That is my Slammy Award, uh, not really predictions. I guess you could just say that's what I would vote for in the Slammy Awards. If you guys want to do this and actually uh, have an opinion, have a say in what happens at the Slammy Awards, then you can head over to WWE.com right now and start voting for who you think should take home the trophies. But once again, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. The Sunny Awards will take place on the 23rd of December. I believe it's the 23rd of December. Uh, might have to double check that. If that's wrong, I will uh, correct it in the comment section down below. But please be sure to give this video a like, comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Ah!